Hello, today I would like to demonstrate the latest features for frame by frame animation. Uh, first of all, I'm going to import an empty image. Uh, this is a transparent PNG file. Then I choose the brush tool, and you can see uh, a lot of brush icons on the tool options panel. Uh, those brush presets come from the system my paint installation. So in order to have them in Synfig, you should have uh, my paint installed uh, from uh, your repositories into default system location. Uh, in the in the future, it is planned to add an option to look for brush presets in different paths, but at the moment, uh, Synfig looks only at uh, one location. This is how it is, and uh, we have uh, a lot of brushes. Uh, not all of them are works at the moment uh, because not all options are supported uh, but uh, there are some of them that work as expected so you can play the thing Okay, also you might notice that now we can change the color of the brush so we can paint with uh, uh, different colors. Um, another latest addition is uh, eraser option. Uh, which allow to turn any brush into eraser mode so we can erase also there are predefined erasers so we can use those brush presets as well uh, the next addition is uh, a multi-device support for the brush tool. Um, in my case I have stylus pen which I am using to draw on the tablet and these stylus have two tips, first one and uh, eraser. Uh, Synfig remembers uh, tool for each and uh, of the stylus and uh, now the brush tool also remembers not only the tool but also the status of the chosen brush and the status of eraser checkbox. To make this feature work you have to make sure that uh, you have input devices configured properly. Uh, for that go to input devices and uh, by default all your devices uh, listed here um, will have mode set to disabled and you need to set the stylus uh, to the screen and uh, eraser to the screen as well. Uh, all other devices should stay in the disabled mode, otherwise uh, strange things my, might happen. Okay, so I have eraser configured as screen and stylus configured as screen. 
So now I already have a brush tool assigned to the um, one stylus tip and uh, let's configure some brush. Uh, this one for example. And uh, now I'm switching to eraser and uh, use it to choose the brush tool as well. And uh, let's choose an eraser. Okay, it works as eraser. Now I switch back to the other tip and uh, I can paint. So now this work pretty much the same as in any other bitmap painting application. Well, of course, all those uh, bitmap drawing uh, and frame-by-frame -frame animation features are still in development and uh, they might be very unstable and have bugs and uh, the drawing is very slow but uh, at the moment it's already possible to make uh, simple frame by frame animation tests uh, for example now I will try to create a simple animation of running character Let's uh, check the preview. Preview. Well, it's not very impressive at the moment. That's because the center part uh, of the character stays in the same place. I have intentionally uh, made it like that uh, because it's easier to draw in this case. But now I'm going to fix this. I have marked the ground here. So I will make sure I'm enabling animation mode and make sure that he will stay with his his feet on the ground at each frame. So I go here. And like this. And uh, let's duplicate this frame so we can put him back. Okay, and uh, let's put better resolution, frame resolution. Well, it's now it's look much better and uh, it will be even even better if we will put a time loop player here uh, time loop 
duration 11 frames and uh, now let's group it all together and let's create a ground for him to run uh, like this yeah yes oh let's save our rock okay we have a ground let's make it thicker okay and now we can make our character smaller and put it put him in the start position then go to the frame 48 for example and uh, move him somewhere far 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 away now let's check the result okay this is our first simple frame by frame animation of course it's very simple and very quick but i hope you already got the idea well that's all for today thank you and goodbye